Greatness. You were put on this earth to achieve your greatest self, to live out your purpose and do it fearlessly. Steve Mirabali. So how does one become great? Well, we're just gonna have to find out. So I've decided to pull the trigger on the trade. Zach Levine, welcome to the Milwaukee Bucks. With the second pick in the 2014 NBA Draft, the Milwaukee Bucks select Jabari Parker from Duke University. So through two quarters into this game, PG-13 and the Indiana Pacers have been killing it from deep, shooting over 60% from the field. But Jabari Parker has been on fire tonight, having a breakout game, scoring already 19 points here in the second quarter. So without further ado, let's get right into the gameplay. So welcome back guys to another episode of my NBA 2K15 My Jam series with the Milwaukee Bucks. So we are taking on the Indiana Pacers in this one. As you see, CJ Watson get the nice jump shot right there. But right here, Indiana's gonna turn it over. We're going the other direction. Cause I'm a beast, and there ain't no one going harder than me. So if you hate it on me, I just let it be. You hate worth my time for me. So as you guys saw in the intro, I brought Zach Levine to Milwaukee and also in this game, Jabari Parker has just been playing phenomenally, showing that he has a lot of potential in this league. And I mean, although his shooting hasn't been too good as Zach Levine gets the dunk right there. But yeah, as I was saying, Jabari hasn't really been shooting the ball too well, but he's really been a good leader on the court. And oh my god, Zach Levine just killing everyone out here. And you guys think Zach Levine can only dunk? Nope, he's making a rain here in Indiana. But anyways, on the in the next quarter, Zach Levine has another chance to the rim. Whether you're playing my GM or my team or my league, make sure you guys pick up Zach Levine. He's just absolutely crazy with the dunks. His athleticism is through the roof. But I was reading the comments from my last video I uploaded, and you guys want to see longer videos. You guys want to see more high quality videos when it comes to this my GM series or any video that I make. So, as I used to do back in like the early to middle NBA 2K14 days, I'm going to start bringing you guys longer videos, 7, 8 minutes, 10 minutes maybe, and I'm going to make them really creative and higher quality than they've been as of late. So you guys can expect a lot of good videos if you guys keep on hitting that like button. And make sure you guys hit that like button. Let's hit 75 likes if you guys want to see another video of Zach Levine. Knocking down another three. He had 17 points in the second half alone. So 93-85 now. Jabari taking the ball. Other side of the basket. Spin move on PG-13. Almost gets the end one right there. But it doesn't matter. We still got the lead. Now Brandon Knight kicks it to Jabari. Jabari three in the corner. That was a terrible shot. So in this game, I am playing on superstar mode with simulation slider. So I have no idea how that ball went in. You guys thought we were done with Zach Levine? Nah. So we are leading by 7 in this one, 15 seconds left. Jabari Parker had a breakout game in this one, scoring 26 points. His career high and his season high, obviously, as we will walk out of this game with a demanding win against the Indiana Pacers. So in this game, I've got two games for you, so we end up winning this game 100-93. to Now let's get right into the second game against the Washington Wizards. So this year in NBA 2K15, they are featuring the SimCast feature now. If you guys used to play NBA, NBA Live, Dynasty Mode had something very similar to this, and 2K thought it was a great idea, so they added it to NBA 2K15, so I'm gonna go ahead and sim to the fourth quarter, and uh, let's see how this game is looking, so here we are, three minutes left in the game, we are down by three, let's get jump right into this game and get that W, or at least try to win this game. So we find OJ Mayo, three point line, buckets, getting the three right there, oh wait no that was a two, excuse me, foot was on the line, but anyways, Kevin Serafin backing down, Fadeaway jump shot, no good. 
Washington was missing a bunch of shots in this fourth quarter, and I'm not really sure why, considering they were some good looks. And right here, Brandon Knight up to Jabari. Jabari pump fakes the three, calls for the pick, gets the pick from Sanders going around the screen, has the ball, and there's a three-second violation. Give us the free free throw. We wouldn't convert on the um, next play, but it doesn't matter. It's only a two-point game. So right here, Jabari finds Brandon Knight, top of the key, getting the three to go, giving us our first lead of the night, believe it or not. But we end up losing that lead later on in the game. Three-point game now, less than a minute left in the game. Brandon Knight almost turns it over, finds Jabari. Jabari finds OJ. Buckets one more time, making it rain here in D.C. So, tied right now, 86-86. We get the steal. Brandon and I going all the way to the rack. No alley-oop to Jabari right there. What a nice play. But anyways, we are, have the lead in this game. Hey, Washington, where are your defenders at? Where they at, dude? Where they at, dude? Where they at, dude? So we're trying to hold on to what any type of lead we have in this game. Three points right now. Trying to get a stop with under 20 seconds left in the game. John Wall finds Gortat. No good. Sondra with the rebound and he's going to get fouled. This has to be a game one at the free throw line. He would make the first one. Miss the second one. But it's all good. 92-88. They got to get a quick three up. John Wall has the ball. That rhymed accidentally. But anyways, Pierce gets blocked the first try. Second try. It is no good. We win this game. Yeah, another demanding win against another Eastern Conference power team. And what a phenomenal win for us. 92-88 came down to the wire. And with that being said, we are now 2-2 two two on the season. Hope you guys enjoy the longer videos that I will be making for you guys. Next episode will be about 8 minutes long. And it's going to be a great episode. So as you see, Brandon Knight led all scorers with 22. Jabari had 17. And taking a look at the rookie report. Jabari is leading all rookies with points right now by 7.5 points. And he's also leading the rookies in field goal percentage. So Jabari's been playing great. The Bucks have been playing great. 2-2 two two on the season. Let's go ahead and win another game. So with that being said, let's smash 75 likes if you want to see another video tomorrow.